A-C-T-I-O-N. Oh, Tommy, I want to tell you, it's Super Bowl time, Tommy. And I think since day one or week one, I told you about Philly. They were going to be a good team this year. I got them an 8-1. to one, And you know what? I got a shot. There we go, Captain 8-1. to one. Welcome to Action Bets, everybody. Super Bowl 2023, Super Bowl 57, uh, live from Phoenix, Arizona, everybody. Thanks for joining us on Action Bets. Tommy D, along with my man, the captain. Boom, boom. Uh, captain feeling pretty good, picking the, che- the uh, Eagles out week one uh, of Action Bets, guys. Go back and watch the tape. Captain called it out at 8-1, to one. so he's all jacked up here, but we're here to talk about the Super Bowl. Uh, number one teams in both divisions, 14-3. Yeah. and three. Uh, uh, you know, Captain, you got no head on. How you feeling today? Well, you know what? I, I got a lot of emails and a lot of calls and a lot of text messages saying that I'm bald. As you can see, I got a good head of hair for right now. Last year I didn't, but now I do. Uh, I, I'm a keeps guy. I can just say that. Great stuff. Use it. There we go. Captain feeling pretty good without the captain's hat. Doesn't need it or not, Captain. Uh, you know, let's take a look at this game. It's in Phoenix. You got the Kansas City Chiefs versus the Philadelphia Eagles. Uh, both number one seeds, as we just said. Uh, you know, the, the the line's been moving. Over and under been moving a little bit. Uh, I believe the Chiefs started off as the favorite. Yeah, the uh, one and a half point favorite. Over and under was 49. 49. Now we're at the Eagles, our favorite by one and a half. One and a half, two, depending on where you go. All it's right. one and a half right now, solid. Over under is 51 and a half now. Hey, speaking of that, guys, if you're in a state that has uh, sports gambling, you know, check check your odds. If you're on a couple different sites, some of these are giving you d- better odds. So make sure you're you're looking for the better odds on these bets, guys. Yeah, uh, uh, DraftKings is, is doing. I I don't I, I don't have an account or nothing like that, but I hear DraftKings is giving a very liberal uh, number. Uh, yeah, I, I, Caesars is doing pretty well. Uh, I saw their numbers pretty good too, and FanDuel. So a lot of options out there, guys, uh, when you're placing your bets here. Uh, let's get to the game here. Uh, you know, Sunday, Captain, we made it to the big game a uh, whole season. First of all, I'd like to thank every single one of you who joined us along the season. Thank you so much. A lot of regulars thrown in the mix. A lot of Sharpies, guys, uh, and girls, you know, yeah. crushing it out there. We're big in Ireland, by the way. There we go. Hey, we're moving up. We're moving up worldwide here. Yeah, uh, we're going Mets worldwide. Guys. God bless. So, hey, thanks again, everybody. And make sure you put in the comments who you like this week with the score, guys. Throw it down there. Let us know who you like. Well, let's talk to the game, Captain. Uh, Let's give a pick out. Who's your pick here this week? Since day one, week one, I've been on the Phillies. Fly, Eagles, fly. Got them an 8-1. to one. Let me explain why. What you're looking at is a team that has had a purpose since week one, since the since preseason. They came into the season filling all the holes, and then they even added more fills during the season. Everything they've done has been right. I think the defense is strong. The offensive line's the best in the league. Jalen Hurts, he was Mahomes. He is Mahomes, what Mahomes was four years ago. The the unquestioned factor that in the game, you have to look at him and say, what's he going to do, run or pass? Because you know what? You just don't know. And I want to tell you, the addition of A.J. Brown, what he has done and opened up that offense. And you know what? The running games with Miles Sanders, Boston Scott, uh, Kenny Gainwell. These guys are doing it. Then you got the tight end, uh, you know, Goert. You can't go go wrong with this team. Great defense. You know, uh, oh, my God, that front line is unbelievable. Uh, And uh, Hassan on the outside. uh, I think he's going to get him three times. I would take the over on Hassan. I don't even know what it is. But I would take the over on Hassan coming in and sacking uh, Mr. Mahomes at least two times in that game. So let, we'll find out what you can get on that time. But I'm on Philly. I think Philly wins this game big. Uh, Mahomes, let me tell you, I've had a high ankle sprain. That doesn't go away quick. I'd rather break my ankle than have a high ankle sprain. You'll heal quicker. With that being said, I know that he, he's going to be playing. I know he's going to be there. 
But I just think Philly's a better team, Tommy. Hey. I really like this team. Who's your pick, Tommy? Captain, the Eagles have been your team all year, so you can't shy away from them. you got to stay with them. I, I can't uh, can't doubt you for that, uh, you know, Captain. I'm going back and forth. I was kind of leaning on the Eagles, uh, and then I was going back to the Chiefs. I'm having a tough time picking the winner of this game, so I looked and took a look at the over-under. Uh, I'm looking at the under. I got under 50 points, guys, if you get anything higher than that. that uh, minus 110, guys. Um, hold on a second. That looks like a parlay there. There we go. Philly I mean, to the under. Hey, there we Action go. Action bet parlay. Let's might, might as well close the season out that Hello, way. Hello, parlay. Actually, there we go. Uh, you know, I'm looking at the under 50. Last, few, uh, last four Super Bowls were all on the under in the big game. Lots of emotions and excitement. Uh, players, coaches, a big yep. game. Neutral site in Arizona. So no home field advantage. Uh, and this Eagles defense is loaded. loaded. Hassan uh, Reddick, uh, three and a half uh, sacks in the postseason. Uh -huh. You got Hargraves, Cox, and Sweat. And then, you know, the biggest key probably with the defense uh, was the signing of Sue, uh, oh, yeah. uh, 49 sacks in 10 games since they signed Robert him. Robert Quinn, too. And then Linval Joseph also moving him around into the gaps, helping out. Uh, the defense has only allowed seven points to San Francisco, obviously, versus a fourth-string quarterback, not saying too much. 17 points and 16 points versus the Giants last three games. And then the other two games they lost, they had Minshew. Uh, and then going back to the other game they lost was Washington before they had a lot of these players, and they were a little beat up at that time. Yeah, so. they were. Uh, I'm looking at this Eagles defense as rock solid. I think Mahomes doesn't have as many weapons. And then I'll take a look at the Chiefs defense. Uh, led by number three, Chris Jones. Expect Andy Reid um, and his staff to move him around all over the field there and cause havoc to the Philly defense. He's the key here. Uh, the Chiefs defense only allowed 20 points to the Bengals and the Jaguars. Both explosive offenses. Uh, so saying that, you know, I think the Chiefs might be able to keep um, Hurts a little bit under control here. Uh, Chiefs injuries, too, on offense. Uh, they got, you know, Schuster, Tony, Hardman. All three of the receivers are hurt. As you said, Mahomes. Uh, There's a little bit of a factor there that worries me. So I'm taking a look at the under here. I'm going to go under 50 points here, Captain. I believe that's a, it's a good play. Well, that's a two-team parlay right there, right there, Tommy. I love that. I like it, Captain. Quick and easy. Yeah, a lot of money management going go on. Go get your money, ball. Tommy. Hey, we get, hey we're going to go get our money. But a, lot, a couple things that worry me. You got some experience. Obviously, you got Mahomes and Andy Reid as the experience here going up against Hurts and yeah. Sirianni. Uh, you know, both first time in the Super Bowl. Do you, do you think that has any factor here in this game? No, I, ju I, just, think, I, I just think they're so dialed in right now. It, it's going to be... It's going to be a really, really good game. I do like the under now. You talked me into the under. I like that. There we go. I like it. Here, a couple trends for you to take a look at. Uh, teams that score first uh, usually win 66% of the time there, Captain. Five of the seven pass years, the under uh, hit. So that's why I'm on the under here. Okay. White jerseys won 15 out of 18 pass Super Bowls. No, don't go there, hey, please. Don't go there. The, white, Captain. Oh. the Chiefs are in the white. That's why I couldn't take, oh, my couldn't take the Eagles. Hey, Chiefs 5-0 and oh, uh, straight up. 4-0-1 against the spread versus NFC opponents this year, Captain. So showing me they really crushed uh, the NFC this year. Andy Reid, 30-6 and six straight up coming off the bye week, 8-3 and three in the playoffs. Andy Reid knows how to get it done with a little more time. That's why I was a little weary on your Eagles. I I'm seeing some things I didn't like. And then Mahomes shows up. He's probably one of the best quarterbacks in the league. I don't think Hurts is oh, quite boy. there yet. Uh, but, you know, some prop bets to take a look at, Captain. Tell me if you like any of these. Jalen Hurts, a touchdown, plus 118. Would you take it? Scoring a touchdown? Yeah. No. No, you don't think Jalen Hurts gets in the end zone? There's, there's other bets. Okay. Go ahead. How about, her? How about uh, Kelsey? Does he get in the end zone? Minus 114. Uh, yeah, I would say Kelsey's going to go there. Even given, yeah. yeah. De Devonta Smith, under 61 and a half. Mm, Devontae Smith under 61 and a half. That's a tangy bet. I'd have to say under. I like the under there too, Captain. That's why I have that one. Uh, Sky Moore, this one's one I think that maybe could be a little sneaky. Touchdown plus 950. So many injuries on that wide receiver court. Uh, Patrick Mahomes all year long. No, no receiver, 25%. He spreads the ball out all over the field there. So I do like that one. How about McKinnon running back for the Chiefs over 21 and a half yards? Oh, I like that. that, that yeah. I thought Pacheco's that was a little beat one. up. Pacheco's a little beat up. And then the last one here, uh, Gatorade color. What color Gatorade, Captain? Uh, blue Gatorade is the most uh, popular flavor when they did a study in 2020. It was the choice out of three of the last red, four years. Red. Are you sure red? Yeah. All right, blue Gatorade, you're still getting four to one. What's red? Uh, I'm not quite sure. Okay. <laughs> Captain likes the red. I'm going to stay with the blue. Okay. Uh, last one I'll ask you, MVP. 
Hurts at 125, or Mahomes at 130. Quarterback has won it uh, nine out of the last 13 years. You know what? I, I, I'm going to have to say Hassan on the defense of the Eagles is going to win the MVP. Hassan on the Eagles? He's calling that. That would be a huge. Hassan on the Eagles, the defense. Wow, that'd be a, that would be a huge a, Super Bowl he, he, prospect. He looks like Lawrence Taylor. There we go. I like it. Captain, a couple prop bets, uh, action, the big game, Super Bowl, everyone. I know you're going to be watching with your friends and family. Share this video with everyone. We appreciate you watching here on Action Bets, everyone. It's such a good time to have friends over, family, eat yeah. some chicken wings, drink some beer, and, you know, watch some good old football. God bless. ACT. I-O-N. We'll see you next time. Good luck, everybody.